Welcome dear friends. Today we're embarking on a gentle journey through the art of patience, a quality that often feels out of reach in our rush rush world. In the whirlwind of our daily lives where everything demands instant results, God invites us to slow down and learn the beauty of waiting on Him. Let's look to the Bible drawing from the New King James Version and reflect on the story of Abraham and Sarah. This couple's journey is a profound example of patience in God's promises. God promised Abraham descendants as numerous as the stars, yet years passed without the fulfillment of this promise. Imagine the faith and patience required to hold on to God's promise year after year, especially in a culture that valued lineage above almost everything else. In Genesis 18:14, the Lord asks, Is anything too hard for the Lord? At the appointed time I will return to you according to the time of life, and Sarah shall have a son. Despite the impossibility in human terms, especially considering Abraham and Sarah's old age, they chose to believe in God's promise. Their patience was rewarded with the birth of Isaac, through whom the lineage of nations and the Messiah would come. Their story teaches us that God's timing, often so different from our own, brings about perfect outcomes beyond our understanding. Why is patience so crucial? It's more than just waiting, it's trusting in God's timing, His perfection, His plans. It's a quiet strength that grows within us rooted in faith, allowing us to endure the waiting periods with grace and trust. How do we cultivate such patience? It starts in the quiet moments, in prayer, in meditating on God's Word, allowing scriptures like Psalm 37 7, rest in the Lord, and wait patiently for Him, to fill our hearts and minds. It's nurtured in moments of intentional stillness before the Lord, trusting that He is at work even when we cannot see it. Lord we thank you for the enduring example of Abraham and Sarah, for their faith and patience in your promises. Guide us to cultivate such patience in our own hearts. Help us to trust in your timing, to rest in your promises, and to find peace in the waiting. Strengthen us with your Holy Spirit to endure the seasons of waiting with grace and hope, in Jesus' name, Amen. As we part today, I invite you to reflect on the seasons of waiting in your own life. How is God speaking to you in the stillness? For more resources to guide you in your spiritual journey, consider visiting livingwordapp.com where you can find encouragement and insight into God's Word. May you find joy in the journey and peace in the pauses. God bless you and thank you for spending this time with me to reflect on the beautiful art of patience.